Hi, my name is Eric Dussel. This is Luke Watson. Darby Pfeiffer is not here today because uh, she decided to quit on us and join another group. But that's okay. We replaced her with a much, much better person. Max Pollock is behind the camera. See, today you'd probably be expecting us to uh, talk about some physics, maybe about some mirrors. But uh, lenses. I'm going to tell you something. Mirrors suck. Mirrors are only good for looking at yourself. Because today, we're doing the physics of soccer. Here at the beautiful Kelly Soccer Complex, physics comes alive. We got gravity, inertia, Newton's laws. We're going to show you here today in this video the physics of a soccer kick. Thanks for watching. Eric, did you know that gravity is the reason why it pulls the ball down your foot every time you kick it in the air? Say what? Due to the laws of gravity, when Eric juggles the soccer ball, it falls at approximately 9.8 meters per second squared. That is the acceleration that gravity has on an object when it's falling freely. Due to friction, when Luke kicks the ball on this great Kelly Field grass, the ball is going to slow down over time. Due to Newton's third law, when Eric kicks the stationary ball, his foot puts a force on the ball, and the ball puts a force back on his foot. His foot has a positive force on the ball, causing it to move with acceleration. When Luke catches the ball, he is acting with negative force on the ball to stop. When he puts a force on the ball, and the ball puts a force back on him. So in recap, we did a lot of things today here at Kelly Field. Projectile motion, gravity, Newton's laws, friction. It's just everyday things that uh, play into a normal game of soccer. We'd like to thank everyone at Canberra School, Mr. Pettis, and especially Darby Pfeiffer. We want to thank her for dropping out of our group, because if she didn't, we wouldn't have had this great filming and editing by Flex Out Films CEO. Hey Max, watch this. Wow Eric, what a goal! That wasn't just a goal Luke, that was physics.